I just wanted to be an encouragement to you today. Um, this is a New Covenant ministry. We are Grace Teaching today. And uh, when we were young kids, we used to have these little tablets, um, little cardboard tablets with a uh, little carbon, and there was a little slip of uh, film on top. And uh, we had these plastic pins that would come with these. And as kids, we could write down whatever we wanted. We could paint pictures, we can write things. And then we could just lift that little piece of film and we could lift it and it would erase what we, what we, what we did. And uh, of course, we could start over. Well, we're going to talk about the word cleanse. Um, the uh, word cleanse actually uh, um, means uh, to clean. Um, it means to thoroughly clean. Uh, um, actually free someone from sin and guilt. Um, and so we know that uh, in Romans 8, 1, there is there now no condemnation for those in Christ. And what that really means is uh, the word condemnation actually means to pronounce guilt. And so, of course, in Christ today, we are loved unconditionally by our Heavenly Father. Um, because of the finished work of Jesus Christ and because um, we have received Him and believed in His name, Jesus Christ, as our personal Savior and Lord. So as children of God in Christ, we were given that right to be called God's children. We are loved unconditionally and accepted by our Father all the time and in right standing. And so that's good news. And this has nothing to do with our physical performance or behavior. And you're wondering, why? how can we stay clean and right in the Father's sight all the time. Well, it was because of the blood of Christ. And uh, I'm going to read about it in 1 John 1, 7. Now I'll set the text up here, the context. Paul is actually um, writing to believers in Christ at this time. And he says uh, in 1 John 1, 7, Now if we walk in the light as He is in the light, we have fellowship with one another. And the blood of Jesus cleanses our sinning. And so, <clears throat> the blood of Jesus is continuously cleansing our sins. And so, as children of God, we can focus on God's love for us now. And uh, we can learn how to be led by the Spirit to do what's right, pure, and true. Um, so, um, be encouraged. Um, the blood of Jesus is continuously cleansing our sins. And so, as children of God, through faith in Christ, when we approach our Heavenly Father, we are clean because of the blood of Jesus continuously, and we are in right standing because of the obedience of the one man Jesus, we were made right in our Father's sight. And so Galatians 5.18 says, now those who are led by the Spirit are no longer under the law. So we just wanted to be an encouragement to you, and uh, thank you for this opportunity. And uh, as we know, you are the most important person here, because without you, we would not be able to teach. And so we just want to say thank you, and God bless. Hope you have a great day.